Hi guys and welcome. My name is Chris and this is Robotics Gaming with Code Vein on PlayStation 4 Part 5. Part 5. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Let's get started. Um, so last video we went to the depths of the first one. I remember what it was called. It was like the depths of the deep and depths of the darkness, I think. Um, so we went through the first one, which I believe was the deep, where we uh, kind of like fought the dark version of Oliver Collins. Um, in that like random map area um we just got quite a few quite a lot of haze Hi. Did you need something? So we're just gonna do some upgrading um let's upgrade equipment what do you want to upgrade not the weapon though Which upgrade veil do you want to upgrade upgrade this again we got a uh, four queen iron let's enhance that and we've also got some. We've still got quite a bit of haze as well, so we might do some level upgrades. We get two levels. Nice. Okay, so from here, right, we're gonna. So we do have that one map, but we're gonna leave that for now and just go back to. Um, where we left off last time, which is. At the ruined city centre. Have we done? Right, so that's 100%. So that's nice. I, I'm kind of liking this percentage thing that's on there. Um, so let's go here. And carry on with the, with the main game. <sighs> so... Uh, yeah, I'm still getting used to, still getting used to this game. Um, kind of, it's it's a nice little um, style of gameplay where you like you you go around and exploring. And um, there are some enemies that can like jump out on you. You have to be a bit cautious. Um, but don't get too comfortable when you're exploring because um, there are like those kind of. At moments that happen where you get invaded and then loads of enemies come at you at once so you gotta try and like you know battle them off and it kind of feels a bit overwhelming so you panic a bit <sighs> yeah there is a good strategy which is find a safe place where they can't go to and then kind of like well i'm a ranged class so i can just like yeah like cheese them from a distance right i've got enough uh i to do that um but yeah that's a nice element to the game uh, so this is the area we got to before, where we like, um, all the last video. Uh, communal gifts. Communal gifts are gifts that require the cooperation of a partner in exchange for the great power they grant. They exact a price from their users when active and consume large amounts of icor. Price and effects of communal gifts vary by partner. Cool. Um, we call these items. Beta comics. Green iron. Oh, let's get this one up here. More queen iron. Always good. Everything down here. Prometheus Vestige Part A. Um, and think around here. Okay. These guys are a bit harder. Yeah, so, we, so as you can see, we've done like quite a bit of leveling up from that last place we went to. We've upgraded our veil as well, and it's kind of, you know, their diff, their, yeah, difficulty and resistance to my spells is pretty high. Apart from that one.
But yeah, so I don't know if, if the enemies like scale with you or not. Oh, it's got bombs. Hello. It's that like cutting distance as well, like their swings. Uh, you you are kind of got to follow, get like right around their back to avoid a lot of these attacks. Um, let's see if that's much of a difference. It's minus 10 weight. It's less damage. I'm not gonna. Might as well stick with this one. I haven't actually done a parry on it on these enemies yet. So just it's a uh, one. One. There's like a one second uh, wait time. You got to time it for that. That one second. And. Fancy cologne. Heal up as well. Probably gonna need it. Whoa, okay. There's the big guy. Okay. <laughs> Move away. The camera angles can be like pretty, pretty troublesome as well in this game. Uh, they're gonna get, they're gonna get away, um, get in the way quite often, especially if you're just like trying to back out of a situation. Alright, so we cleared these guys. Yeah, might as well get another heal in that. Oh man, it's a part of nowhere. Dodge is getting a little bit slow as well. Which isn't great. Um, yeah, pick up this item. Alright, so I did play this before. Um, as I said, I didn't get too far. Um, I got to like the second boss, and that area down there is really tricky. Um, unless you're just trying to run past everything. Under Vestige Part C. Cool. Oh my god, this guy's blocking everything. around here. They put them in like really like obnoxious places.
gonna hit me as well. Oh my god, that guy. I haven't got that uh, much health left. I haven't got any heals left either, so next bit might be a bit tricky. There's a good chance I might die. Well, this beast. Well, especially if she's not taking that much damage. Could literally just go. She's, she's got big area swings. Definitely got to try and like roll onto her attacks. Pushes down. Thank God. We didn't take any damage. There's more Queen Iron. She run off to. Huh? Hey, hey Chumps! What, what the, the hell, hell are you doing, doing here? here? None, None of your, your business. business. Oh, really? Oh, really? Then, then tell, tell me, me this. this. Why, Why would, would scum, scum like you, you have, have the, the sweet, sweet stink of a human, human on you? you? The girl the belongs to us. us. Put, Put your, your paws, paws on, on our, our property, property and, and your ash. That clear? <sighs> Fresh blood is some powerful stuff. You hanging in there? So, what's the plan now? We know it's just a matter of time until they find that missing human. You know the plan. Hell yeah. Let's, Let's hope, hope she, hasn't she hasn't been devoured, devoured by, by horrors, horrors yet. yet. <sighs> well, a little bit of beef with those other guys. I guess they're probably from the... Um, the, uh, the NPCs at the start. We're getting us to hunt for them. So let's rest up here, because we need to. Um, let me just, I'm going to teleport here. I think I'm right in this. I'm not right. Um. Uh, I don't know what it is. Oh, last time I got um, to this part, um, I kind of like backtracked. Uh, I went all the way back and there was uh, another, a new NPC to speak to. Where well, there was like a, a little bit of a boss fight as well. Go back to the parking garage. Berserker, uh, Prometheus, and Astrica. Um, yeah, we're all good. Let's uh, take a walk down here. 
people just jump off. There is full damage. So we've got dogs as well. I think it's best to be aggressive with, with these because they kind of uh, they jump a lot, but before they attack, they kind of like, crouch down. Gives you an opportunity to opportunity to attack attack first. I don't know which ones of these are going to come alive. Kind of crazy attacks. That guy's like very aggressive. Oh man. is not going too well. <laughs> uh, a of blood used to lure out the lost. Uh, there is a high likelihood that you will become surrounded, but special rewards are prepared for those who can survive the onslaught and defeat every last of them. I love blood. This guy. Okay, nice. Uh, okay, so we've done that. I was kind of just being like a little bit like cautious with the last guy. loads of items from this. I 
Hunter, Vestige Core, <coughs> Code Owner Kevin, Excel at Range Combat, uh, features gift that support range attacks with the bayonet. Yeah, so I don't think I'm going to be able to go much further just because I'm um, going to be dead soon. soon. Uh, regen extension factor. Oh, so we get one more of these. I guess that helps us a little bit. Um, which way? I've got all of these. Some more health. We do have these. Um, I guess. Useful. Wish it uh, restored a bit more. We got. I feel like we're going down this way. Yeah, we've gone down this way. Um, so we've got. Head down this way. That's the chest. But I've, you know some of these guys are going to come back. Got them dogs. Um, the big boy. I thought you were going to swing then. We've got the backstab. Sunset hammer. Nice. We are, however, not going to be using that because it's going to be way too heavy. Okay. Uh, Hunter's Vestige Part B. Yeah. 
brilliant. Oh, so we've got that guy in this group as well. I want to try and take him out. Nice. That's a quick attack. They're the same. Yeah, so the run attack is pretty useful in this. It's kind of it's very quick. Um else? Let's have a check for anything else. In this area? My arms. And that's it for this this little bit. Um, and then we've got this, the giant hole, giant crater, which looks like there's loads of little platforms to kind of roll onto. But there is a ladder as well. down here okay and there's a lever Alright, so that's cleared that. So I'm assuming you can go down there and that's like the lift to get back up. Um, the thing is, I don't really have much, any healing things <laughs> if I do go down here. So just in case, I might die from the fall as well. Uh, so this just takes us back, uh, back across this way. We are going to carry on just a little bit further. Hopefully we can unlock some kind of shortcut back. Well, oh, aggressive. aggressive. Oh, that guy's got me. No! Alright, now it's going to get pretty risky. Carry on. We have to. Like little monkeys here. Oh man. They've got magic as well. I'm going to use another one of these. Um, just because I don't want to die. Can we make it down here as well? I mean, we do have... We've got some options. I don't want to get 
to this guy. Whoa, he dodges. Oh man. We have to go with the Just the counter attacks for that spell. Um, I didn't realize he dodges attacks. That was a very subtle, like, lunge forward. Yeah, let's get the guy. No, completely pressed the wrong button there. Prometheus the Vestige Part C. Nice. Head back around this way. There's going to be some of these that come to life. This guy. And... Guy. Just going to shield that. Get in there and get behind his attacks. Oh man. Is it enough? Is it enough? That I'm about to die. Okay, here's down. Do we have any of our targets? He looks like he's gonna pounce. Fragrant tea. Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah, come on, we'll be able to kill him, I think. GXH Assault. New uh, veil. Have a look at this. Uh, GX GXH Assault plus one. A blood veil made from a field coat offers high physical protection and mobility. Check in this area quickly. All right, and now we can open this door. So we've got the shortcut uh, back this way. We do have quite uh, quite a lot of haze as well.
slap lock. Oh. Them love holes going. Okay, um, so there's. So before I go forward, I just want to. I'm going to go to that tunnel. Let's see what's down the bottom. Yeah, I'm pretty curious. anything uh, okay just wondering like could we just run around there don't really need to kill any of these guys. Go for it. Just run. I don't want to be here as well. In this step. Um, I don't know if we can. So, there's a platform there. Um, this. Go on to that one. Because there's an item down there. I'm just wondering if we can go that way and get that item. a bit too far. Yeah, so I kind of want to... Oh, crap. Nope. <laughs> Didn't want to do that. I kind of uh, wanted to roll over. I think it gives us a bit of distance. Kind of hard to tell because you can't really... Uh, you kind of just got to fall, I guess. Um, Alright. Go back. We'll just fall. Okay, come on. <laughs> That's not good. They can catch us up. Alright. Go back down here. Yeah. Uh, taking a bit of damage. Um, this is our next. Yeah, so if you roll off, it kind of like boosts you forward a bit. What we kind of wanted to do uh, for this part. Got a haze back. Yeah. Just kind of going to push us in the direction for this item, I think. Very skinny ledge. Um. The next drop looks like we're going to be taking a bit of damage. Probably unavoidable. I'm going to make sure I'm on there. I don't think that's it. Okay. 
Okay, we made it. We're at the bottom. There's no other way. We're gonna die if we go anywhere else. Um. What is down here? Thing. I feel like we've wandered off into a, a different area. Look, the mist has been uncovered. Where's this place? Just, Just cut, cut straight, straight through the mist. mist. It took a, a bit, bit more, more than, than that, that to keep, keep us from getting, getting lost. lost. Let's, Let's take, take a break, a break here. here. Oh, this? It's, it's called, it's called onigiri. onigiri. It's, it's a kind, a kind of, food of food that's easy to carry, carry around. around. Not, Not that there's, there's any point in eating food, food for a revenant. revenant. Although we may thirst for blood, we never grow hungry. Still, I think that makes eating all the more meaningful for us. We fight. We drink blood. We revive. We fight some more. Our lives are pretty much one endless loop. But every time you go around, you almost forget that we were all human once. If I completely lost the memory of my human past, I wouldn't be me anymore. I would just be... something in the shape of me. I'd look like a revenant, but on the inside I'd be no different than the lost. What's the point of living like that? I served in the army, back before I became a revenant. We always used to eat these things when we were out on missions. I guess... It helps me remember. It was a miserable time, but I made some good friends that I shouldn't let myself forget. This stuff doesn't really taste that great, but eating it always reminds me of those friends. So, I guess you could say it helps me stay me. It's been an important companion. Okay, okay, all set. set. Come, Come on, on. Let's, let's get, get going. going. There's, There's a blood, blood spring up ahead. Be careful not to lose your bearings, bearings all right? right? If we, we get, get split, split up in this mist, mist we may we never, never be able, able to find, find each other again. Uh, G12 Howling Pit. <clears throat> okay. Found a new area. Let me just, I'm just gonna just teleport and see. Yes, yeah, so this is kind of the next big thing. So we still got this bit to do. Oh, I, I could have brought the lift up actually. Although, does it really matter? Who knows? Although, yeah, it gets it working again. Oh, man.
Um, can we? How much is it to level up again? Um, so it's 2,800 for the next level. Still got these two we could partner with to make things a bit easier. Yeah, but okay for the minute. Uh, right, I'm going to leave this uh, end this video here. Uh, thank you very much for watching this far. If you enjoyed this content at all, then please feel free to like and subscribe. Don't forget to ring that notification bell. We will be informed of any future videos that I post. Um, yeah, so once again, thank you and hopefully see you guys in, in the next video. Take care.